We all use software as a service every day, even if we are not aware about it. So every time you use email or watch Netflix or use Google Drive or Google Docs, you are using software as a service. In the video today, I will explain in a very simple way what is the meaning of software as a service with examples that we use every day. So there is no need for any IT experience. Let's break down the term software as a service. The word software is something we all know. This is the application that we get and install on our device and then use it. This can be on our PC, on our smartphone or any other device. Now what about the second part, service? The definition of service can vary. So let's take a very simple example from our daily life, the phone service that we use to make and receive phone calls and send and receive text messages. We have to continuously pay for the phone service to use it. So either we pay per use, so whenever we make a phone call or send a message, we pay a small fee, or we pay a monthly subscription. And if we stop paying, we stop receiving the service. We also don't own any of the infrastructure needed to make the phone calls, like the communication towers. We don't even have to understand how they work. These are owned and managed by the service provider. As phone service users, we don't need any technical knowledge on how the phone service works. All we need to do is to learn how to make and receive phone calls, which is very easy to learn and anyone can do it. We are also not responsible for any technical issues that happen in the phone service. So if there is no network, for example, it will be handled by the service provider. And if there are new inventions